both sides and the top, and it was 133 of these, the little dots. Mm -hmm. And then I did down here, and there was 120 dots. So how many for a whole chair? I haven't figured that out. So you can do it. I know. So I scrolled to end in zero. Tell me the two numbers you're adding again. I can't remember. 120, 130, and 120. I thought it was 133. 133. Hey, Maya. Mental. Do it mentally, please. I'm just using that to remember the numbers. Okay. And... So, 253. How do you know? I added 1 to 10 to the 100. So, you, did you do column addition in your head? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay. Well, so, kind of. Ow! If you wanted to double check... Can you do it another way for me? Um, my decision is down. Without looking down at that, please. Okay. Think for a second. Well, this, this. What should I do next? Any mess around? Um, I said all of them are this. I'm going to do something. So, come over here to the next This one is 43. Yeah, 200. Yeah. How'd you do it this time? Mm -hmm. Well, I took the number apart mm -hmm. and made it 100 plus 100. So that would be 200. Mm -hmm. And then I did 200 plus 30 plus 20. So I got 250. And then I added 250 plus 3 plus 0. Okay, so there were 253 on one chair. Yes. Here's what I really want to know. How many are Was this... Oh, we could do that. But before you do that, was this side of the chair the same or different as that side of the chair? Did you count that? Because I just wonder if we have to count all the sides. So let me, I did count all the sides. Okay, but I wonder if you have to.